Hey guys, my name is Matt and this is my beautiful wife Tracy and we're from the what? The, the Great, Great Adventures. Adventures. <laughs> we are going to do an unboxing and a what Tracy? Tips and, and tricks. tricks. Oh, for the what? The Blackfoot Angler 160, 160 from yeah. Aquaglide. And friends, when we're talking about Aquaglide, we're talking about the number one aquatic toy maker. manufacturer, maker in the entire <laughs> world. Yes, there's competitors, but they don't hold a stick to Aquaglide. And on top they of- They got it down. <laughs> yeah, they really do got it down. Now on top of that, they make kayaks, inflatable kayaks. Yeah. And again, today, like my wife was saying, this is the 2021 Aqua Glide. Give it a hug, Tracy. Give it a hug. Oh, Aqua Glide. The most wanted foot 160. angler boat. Yeah. It is a <laughs> boat like no other yeah. boat. And friends, they're marketing this boat towards people who are fishing because yeah. it is so decked out. It is so durable. It yeah. has all the bells and whistles, everything you could even mm. imagine with that drop stitch floor, those oversized baffles and all, oh my goodness, Duratec lining. Yeah. But friends, I'm here to tell you, there's probably never going to be a fish in my wife's boat. No. No, unless it's those uh, Petridge Farm goldfish. <clears throat> We're decking it out as a leisure kayak, but really yeah. this is a hybrid. This is not only a kayak, but it's kind of the length of a canoe. It's yeah. wider than most, yeah, which is going to- it's 16 feet. It's 16 feet. It's going to yeah. give you stability on the yeah. water, okay? It's got a flat bottom like this. Oh, I can't believe yeah, it. I, we are guys, so excited. We are so excited. We have been waiting to get this, and, and you might be asking, how did you manage to get the Blackfoot How angler. did you get it? Because there's a waiting list yeah, a is. mile is. long. And you know why there's a waiting list? Let me tell them real quick. Everybody. Because of the quality, because yeah. of the durability, yeah. because of the warranty, because of their proven track record of success. You, you have to wait months to get this, but tell them the trick. The, One of the first tips and tricks, friends. Tell them the tip. Right there, when you go into Aqua Glide's website, Life and you side. go into the Blackfoot Angler, once, if you want the 160 or the 130. 130 is a little bit shorter. You'll see it says out of stock. But, there's, <laughs> it's out of stock, I right. want my boat now! But, 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 but for the there, person with patience. Person with patience. There's a little place down further, it says sign up for our, uh, notifications when and, it is in stock. And guys, listen, listen. They will notify you. They will. We had to wait about five weeks. They notified us and we dropped what, what we were doing. Yeah. As soon as I got the message on my watch, I said, it's in. We grabbed our phone. He went to the website. I we mean, added it to the cart because yes. you can't even add it to the cart until they put it back in stock. But friends, that's with their whole lineup. You will notice, listen very carefully. Yes. You'll notice throughout their whole lineup of inflatable kayaks and everything, a lot of them, okay? Because they're so popular. You're not just buying this for one season. Yeah. You're buying this for years. We were introduced to Aquaglide initially because we were online, we were looking at kayaks and we were broke. I mean, we were flat out broke and we found a guy that was selling some through a listing and I was like, man, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I, I, the thought of buying a used inflatable kayak. Yeah. I mean, yeah, you can inflate. You cringe. You <laughs> cringe, you can inflate it in the yard, but I mean, that doesn't say there's not a small leak or something. I was just like, oh my goodness. And so we drove about an hour and a half and we met the guy and the first initial, I was like, those are brand new. That's what I said when I looked at them. And he goes, oh no, I've had these for seven years. And I thought to myself, oh, he just bought it, never used it. And that wasn't the case either. He they said him and his wife were going out every single weekend and they were kayaking. And when their kids were young, the kids went with the them The kids too. went kayaking with them. I go, I don't understand. Why are they in such good shape? He says, that's the quality of Aquaglide. Yeah. That's the durability. And yeah. it, it was a and class two. Yeah. I think it was the Chinook, one of the earlier yeah. Chinooks. And yeah. it had bladders that you could remove and it had that material. But I, I was like, I was just mesmerized. And we got those things. And guys, when we're on, we, we were just we boating last them. week on the lake with those. And everyone always stops us. They always come along. Where did you get those? And I'm like, well, they have a newer version of this, okay? <laughs> These are like seven, eight years old. They're like, no, they're not. No way. 
but that's just the quality of this company. Yeah, Again, yeah. their quality's only gotten better. Oh, oh yeah. So we're gonna do an unboxing. We're gonna show you what this looks like. And, and friends, we're gonna try to give you some tips and tricks. And we have quite a few tips and tricks. We've watched a lot of videos. Oh, uh, we watch videos. <laughs> and, and friends, we've owned inflatable kayaks. We've watched yeah. this video, but there's things that we're gonna show you that maybe the original manufacturer's video, they didn't think it was that important, but I do. Let's do an unboxing. Let me give you some tips and tricks that are gonna help you not only to kayak, but to help you to navigate the white waters. And friends, here's the thing. Again, I am so excited and I'm thinking, Aquaglide. Guys, let's do this. And again, snap, snap, big, thick snaps on the side. I'm digging it, honestly. These are thick, the material's thick, it's high quality. The bag, I was so impressed when it came out of the box. The bag is just insanely well built. I mean, you know, if you're gonna cut corners, a lot of times they just throw in a bag, voila. Beautiful chairs. These are chairs that have the extensions so you can sit low in the boat or you can sit higher in the boat. You're gonna get two of those. You're gonna get a cooler, the Aqua Glide cooler. And they're gonna give you this cooler and it has four pole holders, but not only, all right, can you use these for your poles? You can also use them for your boom sticks, which is amazing. Like if you're filming yourself on the water and you need a different angle, because there's Velcro on the bottom, in the bottom of the boat of the Aqua Glide, they have Velcro. So you can move this wherever you want along the boat to suit your needs, depending if you're what? You're with your wife or if you're going solo. They give you two foot pads, and again, with that Velcro, so you can adjust and put them anywhere you like. On top of that, you're going to get the coveted, what? Rudder fin, you know, look at, look at, look at. How many times have I gone out on the water and I forgot to put this on and you're all over the place, but here, you get one and it's really thick. I mean, it's nice. It's not a cheapo. There's no real way to say that. This is nice. It's thick, it's composite, it's gonna last. You're gonna get a splash guard. This is gonna go in the front of your boat and obviously you're gonna take this out before you deflate it. This is gonna keep some of that head water from hitting you. The chairs, I think are remarkable. I think it's genius how they made this. This is such nice quality. It really is. You have straps that are gonna strap it down. On the bottom of these, it comes with these basically so you don't go through your boat. But you have to realize in the bottom of your what? Your black foot, it has what's called a drop stitch floor with a lining over it. So you're not going through it. It's as hard as this table when it's inflated. Do you understand? And so if you were gonna sit low to the ground, you would obviously keep these on. I took them off so I can demonstrate how you raise this chair. It comes with two of these way. It goes this way and this way, and they just snap on in like that. And over here, they snap on in. So guys, this is the low profile chair, and it also is, oh, the high profile chair. If you're in uh, a little bit of white water, I go with the low profile chair. I wanna be further down in the boat, but if I'm fishing, if I'm just enjoying myself, I think this is a delight. I've been in a lot of kayaks where I was so low down and my back started cramping and I was like, oh, I can't do this. I mean, let's, let, I can't do this, but man, this is a lifesaver, especially if you're a bigger person. It's more comfortable. You can adjust it any which way you want. You strap it in the same way you would with any other kayak. And guys, the material, it's thick. It's padded, it's nice. I mean, you're not gonna have problems with these chairs. It's mesh, it's breathable. And right now where I am, it's 98 degrees and the humidity is through the roof. I'm sweating bullets, but I can't wait to get on the water. And my new what? Blackfoot Aqua Glide 160. It comes with a couple bags. It comes with these, which go under your seat. And what they do is they make like a compartment for you to put a small tackle box. In the back of this seat, they both of these seats have uh, basically pockets. And this one is gonna give you some accessories. It's gonna give you some molly screws. It's gonna give you the Aqua Glide uh, book. And so I really think they've thought of everything here. And again, initially, I am so impressed with the quality, with the durability. 
uh, just with Aquaglide as a company. They haven't failed me in the past and they haven't failed me here. Guys, enough talking about the accessories and the things that they throw in. Let's get to putting the boat out. These are sitting on two eight foot tables. These are the kind of tables you would see in a lunchroom. They're eight foot long. I have two of them side by side. This boat will fill both of these tables and be hanging off the end. And yet it is light enough for you to put on your back because this bag is a backpack. And so you can go one or two or three miles depending depending on how good of shape you are. If you're not in good shape, friends, here's the thing, you're still not gonna have any problems. Why? You gotta realize they sell very inexpensively. Boy, that guy's driving fast. Hey, slow it down! <laughs> oh, I dropped my glasses. Oh, and I caught him! Okay, look at, look at. You can buy, I don't know if Aquaglide sells them, but there are so many companies and what they sell is a kayak cart. And so what you would do is put the kayak, roll it out next to your car, blow it up, and then you slide a kayak cart underneath, you strap it in, and you just pull it. Now this thing that weighs 50, 60 pounds with all your gear in it, or even more, weighs less than 10 pounds because you're just dragging it on wheels. Let's get to the unboxing. Testing, testing, testing. So guys, I'm gonna get my beautiful assistants to come behind the table with me and help me unroll this thing. <laughs> You go that way, I'll go this way. I like that. Woo! Oh, Look, they the have little way. padding in between it. That's nice. Oh my. More little padding. <laughs> oh my goodness. They took care of this thing. Oh my goodness. Is this nice? Guys, when you're listen, listen, listen. When you're watching the videos online, nothing, okay? is going to be able to show you the thickness of the Duratec. The quality. The quality, yeah. the flooring that, I mean, it's a drop stitch flooring, but on top of the drop stitch flooring, you have like this rubber coating that's going all the way over it. This is thick. This is extremely thick. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm just like, wow, they have also a QR tag. So if you have your phone and you don't want to get the paper instructions out, you can zap this and it's going to tell you everything that you need to know about your new kayak. Guys, we're going to inflate this and we're going to be back that quick. Guys, the Blackfoot 160 Angler. I am so impressed with this boat. It's not even funny. I I'm not kidding around. Uh, Aquaglide's not giving me anything for doing this review. When they're talking about Duratec, that's these. These are the oversized baffles. Let me tell you, these are thick. You can just, when you grab hold of it, you can feel the quality. You can feel the thickness. It's strong, okay? Now, one of the things I did is I brought my electric pump, but they say fill it with the electric pump and then top it off with a hand pump with a gauge. Friends, I don't, first time out of the box, don't want to overinflate it. So that's why if you can see it, it may not look like it's filled enough, but it actually is probably pretty close. I just need to top it off, but I didn't bring my hand pump. When we start with the front of the boat. Here's the first thing you're going to notice. How many times have I been coming into shore, coming to an island, coming somewhere, and I bump the nose? This is really really hard if you hit i mean look at look at nothing's gonna hurt that the second thing i noticed right off the bat is this handle if you're carrying this boat with someone in the front someone in the back that's not a problem if we come on over here you can carry it right here in the middle of the boat so you have another one of these another one of these and again you can carry it from the middle you can carry it from the front and the back now guys, one of the things that I love about the Blackfoot, whether it's the 160 or the 130, which it's the baby version of this, but it's not a baby at all, okay, is all of the Molly mounts. And you may say, well, what is a Molly mount? Oh, friends, a Molly mount is what you hook up all your accessories to. They not only have one here in the very front, they have two here on this side, two here on this side. We're gonna slide, there's one under there, if you can see it right there. You have another one under this chair. You have, and I can move the chair either way. You have one here, you have one here, and you have one in the front. Let's say you're, you're, you're fishing, let's say you're kayaking. You can have a GoPro here. You can have one in the front. You can have one out to the side with a mount over here. And so everything that you're doing is going to be filmed. And again, when I'm talking about Molly mounts, a, a lot of people, they just don't understand the concept 
there's three basic versions of things that you can hook to this boat. When I mean see, versions, uh, mounts, okay? One is called Scotty, one is called Ram, and one is called Yak Attack, and I'm sure there's a million more. This is a base plate, okay, for Scotty. This is what it looks like. It fits right here. It has special screws, okay, that screw in right here. So this right here, look at me, Trace. This right here is going to, and this is an aftermarket accessory, and you can pick the company that you like the best, whoever has the products that you want. But this goes everywhere that you have one of these, you can attach something. Okay, so let's say I want to film, okay? I put this in here like that and my GoPro or my camera fits right there. Do you see how easy that is? When I want it off, I just turn this and it should pull off. All right, let's say, follow me, follow me down memory lane. Let's say I'm here and I'm sweating bullets. It's hot, I'm not catching fish. I shouldn't talk like that. I'm catching tons of fish, okay? And I need a drink. Well, I have my Molly here and it has my drink holder. Guys, I can mount this right here in front of the seat if I want to and I put my drink right there, which is amazing. Of that when you're in the water oftentimes you want music L look at this this is a ue boom yes aqua glide does not provide this but they provide the molly mounts you have to buy the attachments but look at look at look this fits in there perfectly and so i could put this right there in the front on the side and i can listen to my music i could have my fish holders hooked so i could have a couple fish holders i could have my drink holder i could have you know my music playing i can set the boat up however i want a lot of inflatable kayaks you cannot do that because they don't offer the mollies do you understand it's on top of 10 different mollies you have this stitching on the side and what this is is for things like this where i can just hook this in like this and this isn't going anywhere now let me try to hook it in like that once i hook that in i i'm not gonna play with it there you go this is totally waterproof so i can put what i can put my wallet in here i can put my keys in here okay i can do whatever this boat could flip upside down but it can't and you're like well, what do you mean the likelihood of you flipping this boat upside down is the likelihood of you making it to the moon within your lifetime. I mean, it could happen, but it's just probably not going to happen. And let me tell you why. Because of the drop stitch flooring, because of the width of the boat, because of the size, the circumference of these right here, okay? Are they baffled? I don't know. I'm baffled about it. But look at, look at, because of the size, it's it's not gonna happen you really have to work hard on it you can walk in this boat you can get out of your chair you can stand up you can turn around you can tra change chairs with your wife with your kids you can stand up and you can fish do you understand you can put an anchor on the mollies you can do everything with this boat this is just not yesterday's fishing boat or today's new technology of a fishing boat this is an all-around great boat for any family for any individual for any fisherman for anybody that wants to do some white water and let me talk about that and you're like white water what are you talking about man i wouldn't take that down white water friends let me tell you one of the things i like about aqua glide is this they do not categorize any of their kayaks with the listing saying hey this kayak you can do uh you know i'm saying white water categories one and two and three uh you need to get this kayak for three and four no you know why the reason they do that is because of safety. Listen very carefully. This is amazing and I respect them for it. You can take a guy that's watching on YouTube or watching on the news and he's seeing some people kayak down some category four rapids, okay? And he has money to burn. He thinks, hey, I'm gonna do it, okay? You could have the best of all kayaks, okay? Made for white water. Yet if you have a novice, if you have someone that's inexperienced, it does not matter what boat you're in. What matters is the kayaker. It's the kayaker that qualifies the kayak. People that are experienced with white water, they know their limits, they know the types of boats that they need. But when I, listen very carefully, would I take this setup down whitewater? No. Why? This isn't the right chair. I want to be sitting lower in this boat. I love how wide it is. I love how long it is because that's giving me what? That's giving me stability. I love the drop stitch floor. Look at this. This is solid. I can stand up on it when it's fully inflated. What I want is something like this. This is padded here. I blew it up with air. This is made by Aqua Glide, and I want to be lower 
what? Lower center of gravity on the boat because I'm gonna be hitting waters. I don't wanna be up higher, I wanna be lower. So this is perfect. And you can even go lower than this if you choose. Now I like these chairs. And again, this is from my other boat. Look at this, look at the quality of this. And again, right in the center, what do you have? You have the Velcro. So right off the bat, this thing isn't moving. And then you strap it in the front right here. It straps to these side latches, okay? You have these across the boat on both sides. And so I'm, I'm hooking it up in the front. I'm taking this latch, I'm hooking it here. So this seat is going to be absolutely solid as I'm hitting the white water. In the back of this low profile seat is another pocket with the manual and a patch kit. Here on this particular one, you blow it up and then you deflate it. And that's this seat here. Now watch over here. When we come over here, what do we have? Well, we have another pocket in the front. Look at this, check this out. This seat, look at, look at, look at, I have a shelf here, which is just genius. I love that because you can slip all kinds of stuff in there. And you're like, oh, Matt, what would I put in there? I would put a towel. If you're on a lake, you're catching fish, like tons of them, you're gonna be sweating bullets. So I would have a towel there. You could slide a drink in there. You could have some suntan lotion. You could have some chips. You could have some snacks. Friends, you can shove it under your seat. How long has it been before your wife gave you permission? permission to do that. And I can't tell you how much I like all of these places that I can attach stuff. This is a waterproof bag. It's made by Earth Bag, and guess what? It just clips on there. It fits in the back. I can shove it under here. I have so much room in this. I would not be afraid to take this for a 10 day downriver camping excursion because it can hold 800 pounds. Did you hear what I said? 800 pounds. You can have your cooler. You can have your sleeping bags. You can have your tent. You can have a TV in this thing. Honestly, go down river, bring a generator. Friends, 800 pounds, are you kidding me? Is if you're going solo, you just adjust the seat so the weight is balanced. It's awesome. Nice. Look at, you have tie downs here, stainless steel loops. They've really thought of everything at Aquaglide. Now guys, when we're talking about Molly attachments, okay, this goes here or any of the Molly places. One of the things that people want to do is they want to film and again, this can extend any which way you want. So this can extend over the water. These are made by Scotty, but again, they have Ram, they have Yak Attack. You can have this so it's filming you this way. This would go on the end here. And it just gives you kind of an idea of some of the things that are available. A lot of men that are buying this boat, they're strictly fishing. You know, but again, when they catch the big fish and they said this, I once caught a fish this big. Friends, if you don't have proof of the fish and you don't have film of the fish, you don't have any fish. You come off to your friends as a liar and I know you're not. So what really what you want to do is have this molly attached. And again, when these are fully inflated, this is going to stick straight up. Your GoPro is going to be here or your camera is going to be here. And they sell a million different attachments for this boat. But the thing that you have to have that Aqua Glide thought of is you have to have the base plates for the mollies, okay? You have to have that for those mounts. If you don't have them, okay. If you don't have these, you can't use this. And yes, Scotty actually sells, listen, listen, listen. They actually sell one that kind of goes over this right here. I wouldn't suggest it. The way they put these on, they're not coming off. Listen, they're literally not coming off. And friends, that's good because I don't want all my stuff coming off and falling into the water because I bought a kayak from a substandard company. But that's not Aquaglide. Have these tie downs in the front. This is thick. The other day I was looking at a kayak. It was in a person's yard. You know what they wanted for it? $20. It was a leading manufacturer. You know what I did? I walked on by. Why? because there's no fit and finish, there's no quality to it. I don't wanna be out in the middle of the lake with my wife or my kids and that thing starts to sink. Look what, you are investing in something that's gonna last a long time. This, they didn't have to go thick, but this is very, very thick and you can see it's tied off and then it's what? It's sealed right here. You have here, you have again, you have this guard that they give you. This comes up here, this comes up here, and this is nothing more than a splash guard, but when you're hitting it and you're just leisure, and there's waves. If there's a little wind, there's gonna be a little waves. You don't wanna be soaked, but this is gonna keep some of that water off you, off of your family. One of the things that I really, let me move all my stuff, guys. I really like about this boat is right here. 
You see this? This is why you can take this into white water. You can take this into white water and you have two of these here, you have two in the back, and when you're gonna be in rough seas, if you're gonna be in rough water, you're gonna open those up and all that water that comes into the boat is going to drain out of the boat. It is amazing. So you don't have to worry if it's choppy, you're on a lake, you're going down a river, you're in a category one, two, three, and four, and I definitely wouldn't take this down to five. I, there's just different things, different dynamics that come into play when you're in a what? Category five rapids. But I really wouldn't be scared being experienced taking this down. I wouldn't be afraid if someone was experienced with me to take this in its current state with the lower profile chairs down some cat four rapids whitewater man what a blast would this be and i know it could take it i literally know this boat can take it whether it's this one or the one that's just a little bit smaller or any other of their boats friends you have to realize this company makes hundred thousand dollar aquatic parks I, I mean, when you're talking about that, you're, they're taking that same experience, that same expertise, and they're putting it in this. This is a quality made boat. It's solid. There's just nothing I can say negative about this boat. I love that they throw in a cooler. I mean, yeah, some of you, I know that you have your favorite cooler, but guys, the thing about this cooler is, say you hit some water, this thing, once it's in there, it's not going anywhere because the Velcro is going over the Velcro here. Let me give you a tip. When you find the place that you want your cooler, open it up and make sure that you push down on the Velcro so it stays in place. You, you really want to do that. If you can't do that, that's fine. If you shove this thing, look at this. See, it's there. If you shove it right here, it's not going anywhere. And you also have these clips so you can, can strap it in. You can strap it here. You can strap it here. You can do so much with this boat. It's not even funny. I even saw someone the other day that bought a fin motor and they put it on this boat and they were flying across the lake. That's not something Aquaglide sells. The reason this guy could hook this engine up, this propulsion system to his Blackfoot or to anyone that offers a standard. Now, look at, look at, look at. This is a standard fin. This is high composite. Man, this, look at, look at, look at. This isn't breaking. I mean, here's the thing. If you're camping on the side of the river, you forgot a knife, you could probably take this and just get through it. This isn't going anywhere. I mean, good grief, this is a, this is a weapon. You could take this thing against a bear if he was trying to attack you to get your aqua glide. Okay, I'm not kidding around. But he had this thing on there, and I was like, well, how can he do that? Where this goes, he just hooked up that motor mount, and it fit perfectly on this device. It's amazing what you can do. But, friends, this is under the water. You could skimp on this, couldn't you? Friends, Aqua Glide hasn't skimped, hasn't gone cheap on one portion of this boat. I can't wait to take it on the water. I really can't, because if it's this nice on top of two eight-foot tables, can you only imagine what it can do in the water? Uh, what did you think about the Blackfoot 160 Angler? Oh my goodness. Um, overall thoughts? really impressed with the quality super impressed we love the boat and we're gonna have more reviews coming up giving you more tips and tricks on this blackfoot angler 160. So guys, this has been matt and tracy from the great adventures, adventures wishing you happy kayaking and happy adventures happy adventures <laughs> Woo!